name is Daniel. I come from Stockholm, Sweden. I'm a digital videographer. Uh, I produce video installations and uh, mostly in club environments and festival. The dome has always interested me. Like I started uh, seeing uh, dome content on uh, a dome we have in Stockholm when I was a kid. Um, that made the impression on me. And in my work, I've been working a lot with immersive environments and trying to create art pieces that trick the brain to believing that it's actually within the three-dimensional piece. I try to create a real-time audiovisual 3D game engine so that I can play a live audiovisual DJ set with live-generated 3D graphics. It's about uh, color, movement, synchronized sound, uh, depth, like sensation, like camera movement. What I've discovered is that the peripheral vision is very important. Like if you engage the peripheral vision, then something happens in the brain that is like instantly believes if, if it's if the illusion not only is like in the focus but actually like immerses you. So here I'm uh, I'm able to work in surround sound and in a 3D space that I can manipulate as I want to. If you want to tell a story or something, you need to be very careful and thoughtful about how you, like every aspect about camera movement and where the attention goes in the dome, like you can pull attention in so many different ways. It's not just like in a regular camera where you have kind of this fixed area where the attention can be. Like you can have the attention all around you and you can pull the attention in so many different, so in different ways. You can just have a small sound coming from a super tiny place in the corner and that will draw your attention. And that will leave like this whole other area unfocused. So you can play a lot with that. So if you want to tell like a story, uh, you need to be very prepared. <laughs>